Well, this is Richard. This is Games Freezer. This is Richie's 10 minute taster for a video game that comes out on November the 5th called Superliminal. I'm looking at it on the PC um, and I'm going to take my first ever look at it right now with you. So let's, uh, let's take a look at a new game and see what happens. From what I know so far it's some kind of puzzle game where you are messing with your are you point of view. Of self -doubt? Do you find yourself prone to minimizing massive dilemmas or for allowing the smallest problems to get blown completely out of proportion? At the Pierce Institute, our patent pending Somnuscope technology provides safe and effective dream therapy while you rest in the comfort of our flagship clinic. Located right next to the secondary overflow parking lot of the University Medical Center. Somnuscult will make your dreams come true. Like the tone already. Okay. Right, cool. Okay, that's that's a good idea. Write it on the wall. Terms of service. Uh, just sign them. Okay. Obviously, go towards the door. What's over here? Perception reality. Perception is reality. Okay. So that's kind of got bigger, isn't it? Oh my god. Ow! Jeez. <laughs> that's pretty cool. Does it get any bigger? I'm not too sure why I've blocked myself in. Let's throw it out there. Oh. Right, okay. Let's move on, let's move on and up. Ooh. Okay, so I've got to try and make this smaller, right? Oh, I see. A to jump. Standard. Terms of service accepted. Congratulations on falling asleep. Thank Welcome you. Welcome to Somnasculpt. Your progress may be monitored by qualified specialists. This orientation will adapt you to eyelids, our interactive, lucid induction dream state in which you retain full consciousness and control. Okay, pick things up. Rotate. Will be. So, what have I got to do here then? Chessboard. Do I have to put the chess pieces on the board? Oh, 
I'm not really sure what I'm meant to do, but let's do that. Uh, hold left. Yeah, I've already done that one. Okay. Let's put that over there. Oh, look, there's a door. Okay. Maybe too big. Depends how far I can jump. I can jump quite easily up there. Right, cool. It's got like a 70s uh, office building feel about of it. Um, also, a bit like Portal with the uh, computer voiceover. Okay, no objects beyond this point at all times. Okay, so I can't take objects into other rooms. So, obviously I tread on that. It opens. Oh, I don't tread on it. It closes. So, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? Rotate? It's not really going to help me, is it? Oh! Pull it. That goes to three. Does that mean that... No. Right, so what am I meant to do? Come on. Pick that up. Um, No, still nothing. Uh, what about this? Is there a way I can... I think that's got bigger. Is there a way I can climb on it? Maybe I need to hit this alarm or something. Uh... Oh! Help! What am I meant to do? Can I pick? I can pick that. To bring that through here. Okay. Maybe I have to pick something up that isn't on that list. Maybe this box. No. I don't get it. What am I meant to do? There's a security camera there. There's a fire alarm. 
that one there. Gonna go through that ceiling light, maybe, if I make a stack. I have to keep that one there. there jump jump no it won't let me jump no objects beyond this point at all times yes I can get that look I could just Yes! <laughs> ah, I see, I see, I see. Right, okay. Uh, I need to make this bigger. Where does it need to go? That's the one, and then put it on here. Right! I'm in business! Hmm, no reflection. Okay, so what am I going to do? Well, I can bring this through. Put this up here. Okie dokie. Pig in a pokey. Uh, okay, right. Can't pick that up. Confirmed. You can move freely, interact with surrounding objects, and listen to messages from your patient care team. Please note that I am the standard orientation protocol and that my voice has been explicitly chosen to remind you that I am not a part of your patient care team. I do not care. <laughs> Fair enough. Okay. Uh, ooh. Right, what's this? I can get that. Bring it in here. Oh. I'm not sure what I just did. I think I opened that end. End door. Right, yes, I'm in, I'm in. Okay. Hold left shoulder button to rotate. Okay. So I can rotate that way. I've got to make this so as it's kind of massive. How do I do that? It's changing your f your field of view or your point of view, isn't it? It's not big. It's not big. It's not okay. It's got bigger. I think it's getting bigger. Don't know about that one. Oh, what about that? Kind of 
I reckon I could jump that. Ah, oh, look, yeah, of course, look. It's basically made a set of stairs. Oh. oh, that is really cool. I feel very pleased with myself. Although I haven't made the jump yet. Right, there we go. During eyelids, you will lose the ability to awaken suddenly due to realizing that this is a dream. Evidence, I have already informed you that this is a dream. You did not wake up. <laughs> Please complete the remaining orientation activities. Okie dokie. Where are we going next? I need to get something in there. So I need this to get small. Even smaller. That's too big. How do I get it smaller, 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 smaller? Is that too big still? That's Is that about right. Oh, yeah, that's about it. Oh. There we go. Ooh, what's down there? That looks cool. Ooh, I can take them. Now I'm very intrigued. What is behind here? Something scary? Dream soda. Warning. You have deviated from the orientation pathway. At the Pierce Institute, patient safety is a keynote in our corporate priority tetrahedron. A variable degree of force can and will be authorized to ensure patient safety. Please return to the orientation pathway. Got a giant can of random soda. Can I go back and get another one? Uh, we'll have red soda, green soda, diets. Oh dear. Uh, I think I better get out of here. Stick with the random soda. Good noise, good noise. Right, okay, let's go. anything I can see oh look is there anything down there no so is there a, some kind of button that I need to press to open that door Oh, that is it, isn't it? Yeah, that one. How do I get this down to there? Got to change the angle of the dangle. To get into that. Oh. oh look. And I'll just put it there. Voila. This game is pretty cool. All environments perceived during eyelids should reflect a typical mental state. If you believe your mental state was compromised by Somnasculpt, please provide a comprehensive, rational explanation in your post-procedural survey. Completed surveys may be eligible for a gift card. Ooh. 
Okay, no objects. Now what? Okay. No items. Video surveillance. People without items beyond this point will be fine. People beyond this point with objects will be fine. Suspension of dream license to up to one year. Fines from one lost night of sleep to four. Be smart. Thank you for not objecting. Okay, so I need be able to, oh no, look, if I put this here, go here, look through here, oh, so how am I meant to do this? Hmm, so, Ah. Ah. See, si, see, si, senor. Righty ho. On we go. Right, what's going on here? We've got a rook. We've got some fruit. And a door. Okay, let's go in here. Let's have a look. Tute ferite. I don't know what's going on. Oh god. This is going to be one of those. Repeating corridor scenarios. Ugh. It's making me feel ill. Um, okay. Oh, that made me feel ill. Um, right, what's up here? Anything? Well, I need to get. Ah, oh, if I can make this long enough. If I make it long enough, I can lay it across the two panels. But now it's just trying to find the angle of the dangle that makes it. I don't think that's going to be long enough, is it? To see that um, shadow, if I can get it so as the shadow is going, ah, oh, look, 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 I think I've got it. I need it to fall over though, don't I? Oh, come on, can I get round there? Maybe if I get round the back of it and just jump into it, it might just flop on. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Can I push it, maybe? Okay. So we just want to... need to get it so as it's oh, so close there's an angle in there there's an angle that's the angle no right. 
just need to get it. Oh. Help. Oh, did that open? It kind of did and it didn't. Right, okay, so pick it up again. Pick it up, pick it up. That's it. No, it isn't. Yes! Let's hit the road, Jack. Can don't you come back no more, no more, no more, no more. Okay, so... How am I going to do this one? Is there anything... Oh, I can take this. No, I can't. Ugh. How do I do this then? Wow. Um can't Oh you twas it. Right, so can't do anything with that in there. So what can I do out here? Hmm. Okay. I think it's a good time to call it. Um, hopefully that's given you a nice sort of 20 minute or so look at what this game is all about. It's really interesting puzzler that I think I'm going to be spending a few more hours on over the next few weeks trying to work my way through this. This one I've got to, I'm totally stumped. Not sure what I should be doing. Uh, unless there's some kind of panel there must be some kind of angle or panel that I need to look at in a different way in order to get through anyway leave me to it hopefully you've enjoyed the video please like the video if you've enjoyed it please subscribe to our YouTube channel please follow us on Instagram and Twitter we're at Games Freezer on both Instagram and Twitter. Head over to www.gamesfreezer.co.uk for plenty more news, reviews, articles, indie gaming, and retro gaming. We are generally on there every day doing something, so make sure you head over there and take a look for yourself. But until next time, my friends. It's goodbye.